Hey there, this is Michelle Pesco Salido. In today's training, I want to show you how to create a Facebook Messenger ad. So what that is, and as I walk you through the process, you're going to be able to understand this a little bit better, um, hopefully not um, confused anymore on how it actually works, and then I'm going to share with you some limitations on this ad. So what is a Facebook Messenger ad? Basically it's an ad that you create that's going to be directed when somebody clicks on it in the Facebook Messenger app. So when I say Facebook Messenger app, you have to understand that if somebody is seeing your ad on a mobile device, the only way this ad is going to work is if they actually have the Facebook Messenger app downloaded. So this is something different than just the Facebook app. It's got to be the Facebook Messenger app. So search your uh, store, your app store, to look for that app, and you'll see exactly what I'm talking about. So just remember that when you're creating this ad. But basically, what we're going to do here is I'm going to walk you through the process of setting one of these up so you'll be able to see how um, this will work. So all you got to do is once you're in your ad manager, you're going to go over to the right here and create an ad. Now, the next thing that you're gonna do is you need to choose this option here, send people to a destination on or off of Facebook, all right? So we're gonna choose that, and you'll name the campaign right there, and we're gonna click Continue. And it's just like setting up any other ad. You're gonna create your audience here, so you'll decide, you know, where do you want this ad to be shown? You know, do you want it in the United States, Canada, Australia, UK? Um, you can even use custom audiences here. Um, I'm not gonna go through, this tutorial isn't about how to do audiences because I have courses for that. Um, but I just wanna show you that basically create your audience. All right, then come down here. This is where your detailed targeting is. So let's just say I'm going to go ahead and, you know, target people who like my page. So I'm going to choose my page here. And then we're going to come down here. You need to choose your placement. So they have automatic placements or you can actually edit your placements here. So maybe I don't want it to show on Instagram or the audience network. Um, I'm going to come into Facebook here. Maybe I don't want to show it on the right hand side, but only in the news feeds. So I've chose the placements and then you need to just set the budget. So in this case, I'm going to leave the $20 a day budget. Um, decide how, you know, do you want to set a start day and end date for your ad? Do you want to run your ad continuously? I'm going to leave all that the same and I'm going to click continue. Um, again, format, you know, um, we're going to go with a single image here, but you have some options here. So I'm just going to choose a stock image for now so I don't have to upload a photo. So let's just choose that one. So we have a generic stock image and then we need to choose the fan page. So uh, most of you will probably just have one fan page here, but if you have multiple fan pages, you need to actually choose the fan page um, that you want this ad connected to. So you can see here, it's got our fan page right here. And then destination URL. So, you know, let's say that, um, oh, this is where you want to change it, okay? So you want to come down here and you want to choose message text, all right? So you can hover over this little I and it'll say a copy of your ad and any text you enter here will be sent in Messenger. So you don't want to choose this website URL because if you choose this, this ad will go outside of Facebook. So you want to choose message text. And so let's just say in this situation, I'm promoting a webinar. So I might come in here and say, hi, you know, thanks for, you know, clicking on my ad. I hope you can join the webinar. And, you know, maybe I want to provide a link here, forward slash, I don't know what it is, webinar, let's just say. And if you have any questions, let me know. Have a great day, okay? So there's the messenger text. Um, your headline is just basically what's already here. You can add something else if you want. Here's your text. Um, join, you know, click here. Join us tonight for our live webinar, etc. You know, write your copy there. You'll see that it'll show up right here. Um, and then here are the buttons here. You can go send a message. Um, you can do sign up. Um, but again, just remember that this ad is going to show up in a messenger. So maybe you just create some sort of ad, you know, that says things like, you know, um, it comes in here and says things like, you know, thank you for being a, since I'm targeting my fans, thank you for being a part of our community. We are here to answer any questions you have that relates to building your business online using Facebook.
Okay, so now I can say send a message. And so when somebody clicks on this, it's going to go open up in the Messenger app and they're going to receive the message that I put here. What questions do you have? We are here to help. So that's the text up here. Did, I may have said that wrong. Sorry about that. So this is the message text. This is what's going to pop up in their messenger. And then this is the text that goes up here. So I might actually want to reverse this around. So copy, paste, and say, hi, we are here to help. We are here to help. What questions? Autocorrect would be amazing. Questions do you have? Have a great day. We look forward to hearing from you soon. All right, so text up here. As soon as they click on send a message, this little auto message is gonna pop up. Send a message is the call to action button we chose. Um, news feed link description. You know, Bill and Michelle are committed to helping you succeed online. All right, so that's going to show up down here. Right down here, you can see that. Um, we have fb.com. That is actually um, the display link that's showing up there. Um, let's see, sponsor pages you tag in your ad will be notified. They will be able to view your ads met met uh, metrics, including ad spend. So you don't need to worry about this here. Um, we don't have any, you know, offline events or anything that we're doing here. And then all you have to do from there, this is how the ad looks. We can scroll through. You can see right here. Um, and then we can go here and we can actually now, what questions do you have? We are here to help. Thank you. Let me add a space here. It looks like I didn't add a space. So just make sure it looks right. Thank you for being part of our community. We are here to answer any questions you have that relates to building your business online using Facebook. And then this little message is gonna pop up. And then all you have to do is place the order and it'll go through the approval process and you are good to go. Um, so I'm just gonna click continue. We don't need to create a similar ad. So once that is approved, it will be running and you can always check it out, make edits in here once it's approved or even before it's approved. It'll just have to go back through the approval process. So I hope that helps on how to create a Facebook Messenger ad. You know, you can get really creative with this, you know, talk to your fans. Um, you can even target people beyond your fans. You can get really creative with it. Just think about what you want to pop up in the Messenger. Now, uh, you know, marketers always seem to ruin everything. You know, my suggestion in using this type of ad is don't do anything spammy. Like, don't just go in and start promoting your opportunity, you know, actually offer help, actually reach out and offer assistance, um, because I could totally see how this ad can get abused and just turn into a pitch fest for some marketer. So use this the right way, use it to build your brand, use it to actually, per, you know, provide value to people um, and build relationships. So I hope you got value in this. Be sure to share it if you did, and I'll see you in the next training video. Bye-bye.